Lab Guy here. We're looking at two Cartravision video cassettes that are in my collection. These two are brand spanking new, still in the cellophane wrappers. The cartridge shell is six and a half inches wide, seven inches tall, and one and three quarter inches thick. Inside are two six inch reels of half inch videotape. The reels are stacked coaxially. This is one of the reels and this smaller diameter is the top reel. This is the bottom reel. There are your normal complement of sensor holes and poker holes that release the cover so that we can see the tape inside and it can be threaded into the machine. This is the front of the tape. Uh, if you're familiar with the era, it's nothing but an over-glorified 8-track cartridge. There's a bit of foam rubber behind the videotape, the half-inch videotape, uh, to help lift it up a little bit, keep it from sticking. When in operation in the machine, two fingers come in like this and pull the tape out and wrap it around the scanner drum which is right here. In the world of these cassettes the red tapes are rental cassettes and the black tapes are the consumer tapes. The difference is the black tapes can be rewound in your home VCR and the red tapes could not the red tapes had to be rewound in a special rewinder back at the video store. Let's open a cassette and see what's inside. They're real easy to open. You take out four screws on the top and lift off the lid. So you can see that the feed reel, I believe this is the feed reel, is on top and the take up reel is beneath. So, let's measure the reel. The reel is six and a quarter inches. I believe that the running time of these tapes maximum is 100 minutes. I can't find any running times on any of these programs. So, it's pretty much a video cartridge of its era. There is a locking mechanism inside that prevented these from being rewound in the home deck. I'm not going to experiment with this cassette to see where it is and how to remove it as I don't know that it hasn't already been removed since the screws had already been accessed. So I'm not going to actually pull this reel out because I've made that mistake before. That is the contents of a Cartrovision video cassette. To recap, there were two types of cassettes, red cassettes for rental, black cassettes for purchase. Red cassettes could not be rewound at home, black cassettes could. The red cassettes used a special rewinder. The cartridge shell is six and a half by seven inches and one and a half inches thick and contains a six and a half inch pair of reels with 100 minutes of half inch EIAJ compatible videotape. The Cartrovision recording is not EIAJ compatible, just the tape. Like many machines of that era, they all use the same medium, but record a different pattern. That concludes my wrap-up of the Cartrovision video cassettes. Lab Guy out.